Hey guys, it is my favorite time of the month, meaning of course that I have another K-Beauty unboxing to share with you guys. Now, if you've been watching my boutique unboxings, you know that typically I do unbox both their Mask Maven box and the BB box, but this time around, I do just have the BB box to share for the month of May. So yeah, I am gonna be digging into this guy. And this is the one that has all of the full size goodness going on in it. So it is a full size K-Beauty box. If you're new to boutique or you're not familiar, I'll link their information down below. I really recommend checking them out, especially if you're a beauty lover or just curious about K-Beauty products in general because I'm just never disappointed with what I get in these boxes. Okay, so again, this one is for the month of May. As I mentioned before, the boutique subscription boxes tend to come a little bit later in the month, so that's why I'm filming it now in June. So the theme for this month is Under the Sea, May 2018. And the card inside says, hey beautiful, we can't wait for you to dive into this refreshing blend of sea inspired skincare. So it looks like everything in here is gonna be all about hydration and replenishing moisture, cooling off after a hot summer day, which is absolutely perfect. And then we open the card and here is a breakdown of all of the products inside. So let's go ahead and jump in. I always get butterflies when I open these boxes because I just don't know what to grab first. So I'm just gonna go ahead and start here. And this is the Dead Sea Mineral Salts Body Soap. So it says Dead Sea Minerals are full of magnesium, sodium, and potassium that help improve skin's overall health and appearance. So this seems like something that's gonna make my skin just feel super smooth. So I'm really excited for that, especially because in the summertime, you tend to show a little bit more skin. So this is absolutely perfect. And the soap itself does feel really soft and buttery. I thought it was gonna be kind of like a coarse, gritty texture, but it does feel really smooth and softening. I don't think I've ever tried a salt soap before. I feel like I've tried like a sea salt scrub or something like that. Like I'm thinking of the one from Lush, but I don't know if I've ever had it in a solid soap. So that's gonna be pretty interesting. Whoa, look at this packaging. And I'm really sorry about my nails, guys. I know that I'm struggling right now. So the packaging on this is absolutely gorgeous. And this is the Aqua Water Drop Cream. So it looks like in the box, you would have had the option of receiving either cream. You were either gonna get the Cloud Cream or the aqua water drop cream, which is the one that I got. And I love water creams. Like I think they are some of my absolute favorite moisturizers in the world. I love the Tatcha water cream. I also love the Dr. Jart water drop. I'm a big fan of the Belief Aqua Bomb. So I'm a big water cream kind of gal. I just love how lightweight they are, but super hydrating at the same time. And oh my God, look at the packaging. I'm sorry if you can see like my lights in the background, but um, wow, that is absolutely gorgeous. I don't think I've ever seen a jar this fancy or owned one this fancy. Ooh, it kind of reminds me of a lotus flower, like just very gently going across the stream. It just looks so dainty and pretty. And here's what the cream does look like inside. It's this beautiful, like light cloudy, aqua blue kind of color. And it does feel just like a water cream where it goes on the skin very pillowy. And then as you sort of rub it in, it turns into like a very watery, hydrating, but very lightweight type of substance. So really love that. Again, this is one of my favorite type of creams, especially in the hotter summer months. So I can already tell I'm gonna be obsessed with this. Next is this toner by Esfolio, and this is their Sea Grape Marine Water Daily Toner. And it says, this replenishing toner preps your skin for the rest of your skincare routine, provides light hydration while supporting your skin's natural elasticity. And it does moisturize, vitalize, firm, and hydrate the skin. And it does have milk protein extract in there as well. Next is this adorable little sleep mask, which just has this cute little penguin on the front. And this is just a sleep mask so that you can get to your beauty rest. And it's actually a pretty large size. Like, I don't know, I don't know if the last time I had a sleep mask, but it is really nice and large, so very, very cute. Next is this three-step sheet mask. It's the Synergy Effector three-step kit hydrating mask with hyaluronic acid, and it actually does have an eye cream in here, so it's kind of a full face treatment mask, which I think is really cool. So you have your eye cream, you have your sleeping pack, and then finally you do have the sheet mask here at the bottom. 
So the final thing in here is by the company Medi Flower, and this is their Collagen Wrinkle Eye Cream. It says that it's a rich, hydrating eye cream that will deeply nourish, firm, and even out your skin tone around the eye area. I gotta say, I think this is probably my favorite thing in this box because eye creams are really expensive. <laughs> like, I think I just bought one the other day from Ola Henriksen for about $40, so the idea that I'm getting this giant eye cream in this box is pretty cool. And this is a pretty big tube, obviously, so this is gonna last me a very, very long time, and I just wanna feel the texture of it. Okay, ooh, yeah. It feels really, really nice. It's a very supple, hydrating type of moisture. It isn't anything super dense and buttery, but it's also not anything like super lightweight like a lotion. It's kind of that perfect hybrid, so I can tell it's really gonna provide a lot of great moisture to my skin, but not feel super heavy or make it really hard to blend my concealer over top. And this also is formulated with hyaluronic acid as well, so also another great way to really infuse that moisture. Okay guys, so that's gonna be it for this month's boutique unboxing. Obviously this box was a lot more skincare centric, which honestly, I really don't mind because I am a skincare junkie. And also because in the summertime, obviously you are showing more skin and your skin is kind of going through maybe some rough patches with the weather changing and the temperatures. So I love that everything in here is very focused on calming your skin and replenishing the moisture and cooling it down. If you do want to check out Boutique, I will go ahead and leave their link down below. You can also browse products individually on their site as well if you're curious or you want to see some other things. But if you guys did enjoy this video, please be sure to give it a like. If you're new to my channel, definitely don't forget to subscribe. Otherwise, thank you guys so much for watching. I love you so much and I'll see you next time. Bye!